Wir laden durchs Getreide, wir tragen wir auf die Saat. Hurra, wir verblöden, für uns bezahlt der Staat. Hurra, wir verblöden, für uns bezahlt der Staat. Hello, this is your Winter Circle. And no, I am not gonna turn the camera around. I am not. You need to see me. This is a song Helga used to sing, ugly, when she worked at that, you know, Kinderheim. Orphanage, yeah, well, for retards. Not really. Not quite there yet. And she, it sounds like this. We're laughing. Listen. We're running around. We're destroying the world. And we're getting stupider every day because the government pays for us. No, I was just inspired as I intended to walk from the bathroom to the street. Every single corner, someone pushing and raping me in, in many ways. Ugh. Disgusting. Disgusting. It's so self righteous as shit. I have no words for that. So what happens in France? More of it? Okay, tell me. No introspection brings ego. Not to everyone, right? I don't know. Maybe to everyone. That's not the point. The point is we don't want ego. That's the point. doesn't matter where it is. France is an example. It can be anywhere. So French people are tiny people. No, not, not Sergio. They are people who are very insecure about themselves as people. Germans are insecure too, but Germans at least have the quality of what they do. And French don't have that. French have like nothing. So when a person has a studied a little bit like the teachers at university, they take something to attach to their, I don't know, to their nothingness and now they are something but French people are insecure because they feel insignificant all of them I've seen it again and again and again I don't know they have that thing where they diminish each other from birth from the start now Germans do that too they diminish their children by discipline them let them cry yeah it's inconceivable for Latin mentality let your baby cry don't pick it up are you joking that's cruel yeah Germans say gotta be disciplined so you got these disciplined people who work well, they make me like Eisen, but are completely abandoned as a person. So they build up their ego, on, not on character, not on personality, because the government provides, yeah, taxes. I don't know, is that a new thing? Tax return? There is no tax return in Germany, at least not when I was there. Because the government takes the taxes from your job and provides you with everything. Beautiful landscaping, cities, all new, and health insurance, as much as you want. And if you don't get a job, the government gives you money. Arbeitslosengeld. Arbeitslosengeld. France is a paternalistic state too. I don't, I don't know how it works. But the point is, you see, I, I am Princess Luke and abstract things. Everything I had to know for today, I learned it, everything. Yeah, it's a lot of things to learn, you guys. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> Abstraction is that I just can only so observe that French people usually don't feel like they're worthwhile because they're not educated nicely, but they also don't have quality. Because there is this French term, it's called laissez-faire. Meaning, yeah, let it glide, let it, like, just have a, have a relâché, have a chill. That's a good one. Chill. Yeah, maybe that's what that is. Chill. I don't know where to go because it's so loud. Like, don't, 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 don't you worry much. French people are lonely people, man. Lonely. I've never seen so many lonely people going to the supermarket to buy food for like one person or one meal. I lived one year in France. I lived... I went to the gym. Yeah, because I didn't have a shower, man. <laughs> so I showered in the gym. And some French woman talked to me. We talk. Ciao, hi. So next day I come to the gym and I say, hello. I say hi to her, salut. And she looks at me, she doesn't respond. 
And I look again, I say, what happened? I mean, I come not from Germany, I come from Mexico, it's inconceivable. I looked again and I noticed what happened. It's not that she wanted to ignore me. No, the thing is this, we did talk the day before. The land the man. Yeah, land the man, man. Yeah, I lend your hand, that's what I do, I lend your hand. But she did not felt important enough that I would remember her or wanting to talk to her again. What? In Mexico, we're friends. We just talk one day, now we're friends. We know each other. Yeah, cool. Ciao, ciao. That's how insignificant feel the, the French people felt. Yeah, I had the friend. Yeah, we're friends. She allowed me, gave me a peek, invited me to her house. French people don't invite you to their house. He did though. She did. Oh, he too, right? I forgot about that one. An engineer. That was a friend too. So I had two of them. Florence and the engineer. Yeah, briefly. They both invited me to their homes. So I could see. Just to sustain what I just told you. Insignificant. No self-esteem. That's sad. And then Florence told me, she, she won an award after that year, like the best student. So let's say she's got an authority to actually say. No, she had a stack of papers, like colors, like all kinds of colors. She would arrive to the class. And when the teacher started aula, an aula, which is a large thing, right? So when the teacher started talking, all in a sudden, everyone would grab their papers. And I looked around what's happening. And everyone would start writing. I, I, where I come from, we don't, we don't write. We, yeah, we have Stichpunkte. We write a few pointers to remember. Yeah, a few things maybe. A quote? Barely. But no, they would write every single word coming out of the teacher's mouth. The, for I come from, you, you comprehend what the teacher says. You understand what he says. You comprehend, you absorb it. And then to know what was talked about, you make a few pointers and you got also booked to refer yourself to if you had to. But no, they're not. And Florence explained it to me all by herself. I didn't say it, but she noticed. That's a good thing. She noticed me looking at that. She said, no, 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 no. She said, here in France, the teachers expect you to vomit the course back out and the exam. Vomit the course back out. <clears throat> Just like word by word. Yeah, add that to the, to the right student, Jura student, law student lost in that doesn't work out i was highly disappointed when i arrived in france there was a director of an institution he let me down he made promises like mexican assholes he never had the program from me from the beginning he didn't have it he just said yeah yeah come on here i don't know what he was expecting i don't know who gave him money for what he was cheating and lying and I made a conclusion, which one was it? They're disorganized like Mexicans. And what was the other side? I forgot. Egotistical like Germans? No, I don't know. I'm not sure what I said. 